good English or not, it's very simple. I spell the word one time. That's the challenge. I'm not gonna spell it 15 times. You gotta figure it out after one time if it's good or not. Here we go. This is a lot. A-L-O-T. A lot. Good or not good? It's very simple. You click the smile emoji if you think it's good. Click the cry emoji if you think I spelled it incorrectly. A-L-O-T. A lot. A lot of English learners don't have anyone to learn with until they find Lucas. Because you're welcome to join our community just for free. It is free. Just go to learnwithlucas.com and you can find it. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Do you guys need a wake up call? Because every single person here is wrong, except for three people. Did I say space? There has to be a space, guys. You are all wrong. Congratulations. It is A, space, L O T. <laughs> Congratulations to the three people that said it was incorrect. You didn't explain the rule in the rules. Do I spell it correctly? Yes or no? A space is part of the spelling. A dash is part of the spelling. Hope the next one is gonna be better for you guys. I hope the next one is gonna be better for you guys because this is simply a space L-O-T. A lot. All right, here's the next one. Am I spelling it correctly? Yes or no? The word is there. T-H. I E R. There. As in, you know, their English class. I really want to join their English class. I think it's a nice place to go. One more time. Their English class. T H I E R. Good English. Or not. If you think it's good, smile emoji. If you think it's not good, cry emoji. And if you have dyslexia, sorry. Of course, if you ask me, did you say this? I'm not going to answer your question. That's the whole point of the challenge. I'm not going to give you the answer. But I can tell you that T-H-I-E-R is not there. It is, of course, uh, 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 incorrect. Because it is T-H-E-I-R. Well done to most of you. Well done to most of you. It was incorrect. <laughs> I spelled T-H-I-E-R. I didn't say anything else. I spelled T-H-I-E-R and this is incorrect. You didn't listen carefully. Hey, that is the challenge, right? Can you listen well? W-E-I-R-D. Weird. Good or not good? You want to join makeup gang? Why? Makeup gang makes you feel excited. That's kind of weird. W E I R D. Is this good English or not? How many questions? Depends on you. If it goes fast, more questions. If it goes slow, slower. Is weird spelled weird or not? Is it correct? Smile emoji, not cry emoji. Well, I can tell you that W E 
I R D is perfectly correct. Ding, ding, ding. Well done to you. Weird is of course W E I R D. Well done, well done, well done. Here is the next one. Is it spelled correctly? Yes or no? The word is until. U N T I L L. Until. Until you start speaking, you won't improve your English. I'm from the Netherlands. Nice to meet you. I am from the Netherlands. Nice to meet you. U-N-T-I-L-L. -L. Is this correct English? Yes or no? That's the whole challenge. If it's not correct, you just click cry emoji. If it's correct, you click smile emoji. No trickery here. Very simple challenge. Congratulations to most of you because until of course doesn't have a double L well done Don't spoil the result guys. Don't spoil the answer for other people. Okay, but well done to you It is of course <laughs> Wrong All right a little bit more tricky word for you Thanks so much for your gift Luna coming in with superpower. That's that's the way to win. Um, gauge. G U A G E. Gauge. As in, I'm gauging. He's not really paying attention. Is it co correct or incorrect? G U. A G E Gauge Not as engage but gauge as in I'm gauging like I'm 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 thinking gauge I told you gotta have some trickery in between because it looks pretty good to me Most of you think gauge is spelled wrong with a G U A G E. Well, I can tell you it's spelled wrong. You are correct. Bing, bing, bing. Well done. You can have another game after this game. Congratulations. I make the rules. Gauge in this case is spelled incorrect. It has to be A U, not U A. A U. Well done. <laughs> Here's the next one. Is it good English or not? The word is receive. R E C I E V E. Receive. I am receiving a lot of questions. Even though I thought I explained it clearly. Receive. R-E-C-I-E-V-E. -E -E. Receive. Oh, we got a 50-50 going on. <laughs> Ha. <gasps> Receive. Very nice. Very nice. R-E-C-I-E-V-E. -E. I, E, or E, I. What is the right order? Well, I can tell you that those that thought it was correct are wrong. Because I spelled receive incorrectly. It is not I-E. 
It is E I. Well done to those that are guessed it was incorrect. Well done to you. It's not easy. Simple grammar can be very confusing. Now, guys, are you coming to join our server? Coming? C-O-M-M-I-N-G? I mean, you can really... You should be uh, coming to my website to join our free community. We got Telegram, Discord, WhatsApp. Great places for you to learn. All you need... To do is come, C-O-M-M-I-N-G, coming. Good English or not? This is a nice beat. I like this beat. I like this beat almost as much as I like your answers because you are perfectly correct it is of course eh, 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 incorrect no double m's needed here just one m because the origin is come we add ing take the e away coming thank you so much queen of the roses perfect for you good very, very good. Hmm. All right. Ready to level up? Those were, those were a warm up. Now it's time to level up. Is it good English or not? Because sometimes you truly do not know how it's spelled. T-R-U-E-L-Y. Truly. Is it good or not good? You gotta pay attention. How to spell truly? Is it T-R-U-E-L-Y? Yes, click the smile emoji. No, click the cry emoji. Truly, my friends, if you truly want to improve your English, you should truly join our community. That's a lot of trulies. T R U E L Y. Well, my friends, it's not a hundred percent. You still, it's a two thirds against one third. Ooh. Well, I can tell you that truly with T R U E L Y. Even though you think it's correct, it is <laughs> incorrect. Truly has no E. It is simply T-R-U-L-Y. Truly. And look at that real MVP. Thank you so much. Well done, well done. Thank you so much, Luna and Anna coming in with a flame heart. Appreciate you. Too easy? Still too easy? Hmm. All right. Well then, it occurred to me that I have to make this more difficult. Occurred. O C C U R E D. Occurred. Another game not gonna happen. You don't make the games. How about you go live stream, then you make the drawing game yourself and you can do the challenges. Here, we play this game. Occurred. O-C-C-U-R-E-D. Cheers. Ahem. <clears throat> Ooh, just guess, guys. Smile emoji or cry emoji? I repeated it twice! 
If you still didn't listen after twice, then the challenge is for you to listen better. Double C is incorrect. No, it's not. A Kurt does have double C. However, it also has double R. So congratulations to those that guessed incorrect. Well done, because I spelled the Kurt with one R. But it has two R's. Well done to you. <laughs> double C, double R. O C C U R R E D. Got him. Hey, you wanted it more difficult? You get it more difficult. Here's the next one. <sighs> it is. It is definitely getting harder. How to spell definitely? Is it spelled D-E-F-I-N-E-T-E-L-Y? How to spell definitely? Is this good or not good? If I spell it correctly, smile emoji. If I spelled it incorrect, cry emoji. One more time. D E. F I N E T E L Y definitely fifty fifties guys fifty fifties you're like but why are the other people picking the other one why but it, it must be good it must be incorrect it must be correct it must be wrong I spelled definitely as D E F I N E T E L Y. And I can tell you that I spelled it incorrectly. I spelled it incorrectly because it is it is D E F I N but not N-E-T-E, -E. it is N-I-T-E-L-Y. No N-E, yes N-I. Defini, definitely, definitely. Got it? You wanted it more challenging, you get it more challenging. <laughs> Is the word spelled correctly, yes or no? Is it spelled correctly, yes or no? Uh, it can be hard and uh, you guys, sometimes you just don't know, you s are separated. Separate, S-E-P-E-R-A-T-E. -E. Is it spelled correctly? Yes or no? Separate. It's a difficult word. S-E-P-E-R-A-T-E. -E -E. Spelled correctly, yes or no? That's your speciality? Separate, separate, S-E-P-R-A-T, good English or not so good? You think it is not so good and I can tell you that it is <gasps> not so good, well done, it is not S-E-P-E, -E. it is of course S-E-P-A. R A T E. Sa pa. Uh, uh, uh. Not sa pa. Uh, uh, uh. Separate. 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 Well done to you. Here's the next one. Is it spelled correctly? Yes or no? Uh, I gotta check my calendar. Calendar, C A L 
E N D E R. Calendar. C A L E N D E R. Sorry, I gotta check my calendar. I'm not sure. Uh, let me see. Yes, you can join our community for free. Good evening, Chloe. Calendar. Oh, oh, are you sure? Are you sure you want to guess that one? You don't want to change your vote to the other one or to that one? <laughs> well, I can tell you that calendar is spelled absolutely incorrectly. Well done to you. It is, of course, not calendar, but D. A R at the end. D A R, not D E R. Calendar. Calendar. Well done to most of you. Well done. Calendar. Too many E's. Too many E's. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> is it spelled correctly, yes or no? Tomorrow is Sunday. T. O M O R R O W Is tomorrow spelled correctly? Yes or no? T O M O R R O W Wow, you guys really seem to be agreeing about this one. I'm glad you're all on one team, but what if you are all wrong? Huh? What if you are all wrong? How does that make you feel? At least you're not alone, right? O M O R R O W is, of course, perfectly fine. Well done. It is perfect English. Well done. <clears throat> well done, well done, well done. All right. The beginning of the end. I will give you three more. Let's do three more. You're already guessing. I didn't even say anything yet. Because on occasion, we can definitely have a conversation. Occasion. O C C A S S I O N. Occasion. On occasion, at a certain time, on occasion. It can definitely be tough to know if what Lucas is saying is right or wrong. Occasion. O C C A S S I O N. Good English or not? If you think it's good, smile emoji. If you think it's not good, cry emoji. My name is not Paul, my name is Lucas. Most of you think it is not good. And I can tell you that you are correct because it is not good. No double C, double S. Double C, yes. Double S, no. One S. One S is correct. Occasion. Long A, one S. Thank you very much. Well done to you. Well done to you. No double S. One S. Occasion. <gasps> All right. Here's the next one. Only two left. Is it good English or not so good? <sighs> independent. Independent. I 
N D E P E N D A N T. <sighs> what a long word to spell. But is it correct or incorrect? I N D E P E N D A N T. <laughs> it's almost turning into a song. Almost turning into a song. I am an independent teacher, not linked to any school. Independent. Ooh, 12 of you think it is correct. However, 47 don't agree. It's a long word. It's a confusing word, but I can tell you that independent, the way I spelled it as I N D E P E N D A N T is incorrect. It is not at the end D A N T. It is spelled D E N T. Well done to most of you. Well done. All right then. All right then. Let's do the last one of today. Let's make it a long one for this challenge. We have two more challenges to go. But the last one for this challenge is, of course, the beautiful word accommodation. Is it spelled correctly, yes or no? Accommodation. A C C O M M O D A T I O N. Accommodation. Good English or not so good? A C C O M M O D A T I O N. I feel like a typing machine. I feel like Google Translate. Bah, bah. A C C O M M O D A T I I O N. Can also be like a rapper. A C C O M M O D A T I O N. Whew. Finishing with an almost 50-50 beautiful. That means uh, some of you got it wrong. But who? One more time. A C C O M M O D A T I O N is Bing 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 Correct English. Well done. Double C Double M is good English. Well done to you. Oh, that was challenge number one. Is the grammar good or not good?